Hello everyone, my name is Mateo Salvador. Welcome to Airport Sim. This is a ground handler simulator. And um, if you want to play it for yourself, the demo is currently available for free on Steam. And the game is set to release on quarter three of 2023. Now with that said, I don't have any motivation to play my normal games, so I figured, why don't we try this game out today? Um, so without further ado, we're gonna get into this and um, we're gonna play, we're gonna hit new game. Uh, free play, challenge mode. Scenario is the only one that's currently available in the demo. Free play, in this mode you are in for the most fun and freedom for your ground handle and career. Explore airport operations at your own pace or sit and watch planes fly by. Points are not awarded and the completion of scheduled tasks is optional. Ah, oh, that looks cool. Pre-take in challenges where you'll have to complete various tasks under pressure of time. Remember that every mistake will cost you precious seconds needed to complete your task. So these are two things that will be available in the release. But as of right now, scenario mode is the only one that is available. So we will play this. Um, take on the role of an airport ground handler. You'll be responsible for handling aircraft ar arriving and departing based on timed, realistic schedules. Also, when performing tasks, you'll you will earn points, rewarding your commitment and precision of getting aircraft moving. Nice. When the game releases, it looks like we will have three airports to choose from. Warsaw in Poland, Vagar, which is in the Faroe Islands, I believe is what it's called. Uh, yeah, and then we have Keflavik, which is in Iceland. In the demo, we only have Vagar, so I guess we will go here. Click on that. Built by the British Army Royal Engineers during World War II, and the first airplane la Lana did, <laughs> landed, uh, just spelling error, it's fine, in autumn 1942. After the war, it was left unused until it reopened in 1963. New airport terminal was opened on the 17th of June 2014. To this day, it is the only I airport on the Faroe Islands. Oh, look, I was right. Um, ooh, so we'll have workshop. So it looks like we'll have steam workshop and obviously standard in-game scenarios. So that's pretty cool to see. And a leaderboard, which we don't currently have access to. So quick turnaround procedures. Try yourself a routine ground handling job. This time you'll be handling aircraft from the arrival to departure. Okay, that's cool. Okay, and here we are. Yes, okay, just took a second to load in. Though, well, unfortunately the game doesn't have settings yet, so um, I can't go into any of the options because the the... The mouse sensitivity is a little bit high, but I assume that they would probably... Oh, look at that. That's cool. You can put on headphones to, like, block audio, you know, so that the planes aren't too loud and everything. That's actually pretty cool. Okay, um, so we're here now. Um, and I was going to say, the mouse sensitivity is a little bit high, but I can control it. It's fine. So, it's raining. Obviously, the weather is just amazing. Why is it that whenever I record a video, it's always raining? You know, whether we're in Run 8 or we're playing Flight Simulator, it's always raining. Why? Why Why is this the case? I don't understand. Well, I guess this is the time for us to kind of explore. Oh, F to push. Oh, look at that. Hold on. I got to turn down the audio. It's a little bit loud. Okay, well, that's pretty cool. Look at that. Sorry, obviously if you're new to the channel, you're learning that Mateo loves buttons and interactive objects. So we have a plane here and it is coming in. 737 Max, I think these are. I'm not great with my, although, yeah, yeah, 737 Max, right? I'm not too good with my airplane names. Um, but, but yeah, all right, cool. So this is pretty cool. I'm just gonna stay where it's safe out of the rain. And uh, I'm just going to turn down the audio a little bit more because it is a wee bit loud. Or maybe it's not loud at all and I just think it's loud. Either way, I, I, I feel a little stressed out when it's when I look over at my audio levels and it's a little higher than normal. Okay, okay. I, I assume that the plane might be marshalling itself in then. Uh, yeah, uh, come back this way, I guess. This, this airport doesn't have one of those, like, digital whatchamacallit screens, so... I guess it's just marshalling itself then. Okay, cool. Uh, oh, you know what we could have done? We could have turned... I'm big Dumbo. We could have turned on the, uh, the headphones. Shattering our eardrums. I'm sorry about that. We could have totally just... Mateo, headphones. 
which is pretty cool. Okay, so they want us to put cones down. All right, so cone. I grab cone. Oh, no, maybe we shouldn't do that. Uh, I'm just going to drop that. Maybe this is what they want. Okay, maybe we put the wheels down first. Okay, I feel like this is a little bit dangerous. Uh, okay, the engines are off. It's fine. I was just going to say, uh, that's that feels a little bit dangerous. All right. Let's uh, let, let's get the, uh, what do they call these? The chalks? The chokes? The chokes? Uh, I don't, I'm terrible with names. All right, let's get the uh, the cones here. <laughs> I got to say, this is pretty cool, actually. Uh, oh, how, hello? Hello? Uh, okay. Uh, nope. Hello, how do I operate you? Oh, okay. That's how I operate it. Okay. Hey, we could take off our headphones. It's not too loud anymore. Or maybe it is. I don't know. Listen to those sound effects. That's really nice. Okay, you know what? Maybe I'll just keep these on. But then it's a little too quiet, in my opinion. All right, grab. Let's uh, let's get the last one here. Where Where is our team? Our, isn't the team supposed to be helping us? There we go. Hopefully it's not too loud. If it's too loud, I could just like turn it down a hair. I, I had it down a lot, um, and then I realized, hey, Mateo, maybe you don't need to turn it down all the way. Um, you know, you could just use your headphones if it gets too loud, because the game allows us to use such things. All right. Here we go. We got two more to go here, and then we are good to rock and roll. Look at that. Man, I got to say, this looks really good. Okay, shablam. Now, I know that there was a ground handling sim that released a couple months ago. Um, and it was like a virtual reality ground handling simulator. And um, I, I guess the devs of that game abandoned it. And it's a shame because it looked really good. Okay, shablam. There we go. Okay, so now what? Um, hello? Ooh, I wonder if there's a cockpit in there. I'm kind of curious about that. Now what do we do? Uh, I assume that maybe... Oh, look at this. How do, how, what do I do? Player tasks only. Uh, ah, okay. Who, who are you? Okay, secure area around aircraft at gate three. Place chalks. I did that already. Oh, wait, do I have to put one around the front wheels? Per I would assume, yes. Okay, yep, I would assume that this is for the front wheels. Sorry, Mateo's big dumbo. He doesn't really know what he's doing. There we go. Uh, do I need another one? Wait, hold on. Okay, so I did that. Connect GPU to the aircraft at gate number three. Uh, is this gate number three? No, this is gate number one. Oh, look at... Okay, so we, we kind of get to run around a little bit. And then connect stairs to the airplane. Okay, so... No, this is gate number one. Gate number two. Are you gate number three? You are gate number three. Okay. Uh, no, you're gate Charlie. Uh... Okay. Okay, you already have everything. What is this? Oh, look at this. Oh, well, that's pretty cool. Okay, interesting. So, can we just go through all of this then? Connect stairs to the airplane. I would assume... Oh, but you're gate number... Okay, I guess that's gate number three then. Okay, so what does he want us to do? He wants us to connect the GPU, which I assume is this thing just here. Okay, so let's get into the tractor here. I guess we're playing farming sim now. Okay, so turn on the engine. Listen to that. Wow, that sounds pretty nice. But that actually does sound really nice. All right, let's back it up to the uh, GPU card here. Uh, how do I do this? Do I just... Oh, okay, there we go. And then if I take this, and I can now just drive. Now, where do I put you at? Uh, I would assume in the front somewhere, right? Where do I put you at? Um, oh, no, no, no. You're, um, the, the place to put the GPU is here, right? Hello? Oh, okay. Wait until animation has finished. Yes, yes. Okay, so how do I operate you? Um, I don't know how to operate you. Okay, I open. 
Okay, I open that up. Uh, wait, how how does one do such things? I'm sorry, these pilots are probably like, what is this idiot? Oh, okay. Oh, well, that works. Okay, so I did that. Um, now, how do I start this thing? Emo mode. Okay. Uh, are you working now? No, I don't think you are. Nope. Uh, how do I start you? Wait, maybe there's a switch somewhere. Oh, okay. I clicked the power button. I assume that that works now. So engine power on. And that hasn't done that just yet. Okay, so how do I... Do I... Uh... Oh. Okay. Are you running now? No, well, okay, so that that's on. How do I... Oh, okay, now you're running. Okay. Now, how do... Okay, so I click that. Ah, okay. I just did it. Nice. All right, Mateo's learning. <laughs> So, wow, look at that. That's pretty cool. All right. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Uh, not I. I want to hit tab. Um, so the next thing is I have to connect the stairs to the doors. Open the doors. Secure passenger doors with safety barriers. Okay. Now I get to unload luggage. All right, sick. So let's go over here and let's grab the cart. No smoking area. Huh. Okay. So now I grab this guy and I can... Start the engine? Oh, yep, okay, the engine started. And if I hit I, that works the windshield wipers. So there we go. <laughs> what are you? Can I click anything else around here? No, I can't. Okay, well, that's okay. So how do I, like, see where I'm doing? I, I would assume that I just drive this up like this, right? <laughs> let's, let's not destroy the airport, shall we? Wait, can I... No, okay. Is there a way... Okay, uh, I mean, I guess... Controls. Oh, look at this. Okay, cool. So if I just shablam like that, and then... So, I mean, because that's... That's pretty much there, right? Oh, look at this. Okay, so I drag that, and then I drag that, and then can I open doors? No, I can't. Okay. Hello? Okay, so I have to enter. No. Okay. That's not how this works. Oh, here we go. So, F1 and F2 is for camera controls. Okay. Now, how do I know when I've made it? Like, I mean, I assume that that's not making it. Sorry, as you can see, Mateo has obviously never done this before. Hello? Okay. So, I just... Uh, open plane doors, secure doors with barriers. Okay. Well, I can't... I can't open doors. Maybe it wants the doors... Sorry, okay, so... Hi... Hi... Oh! Okay, look at this. Cannot... Oh. Okay, so I have to have the supports down. And then if I... Uh... That doesn't look right. Okay, hold on. Obviously, that's not how it's supposed to operate. So... Oh, okay, so that does that. Okay, so why puts the supports down? Uh, yeah, that's not that's not supposed to be like that. Sorry, hold on, back it up. Hello, can you? Uh, that's not. That's. That's not really okay. <laughs> Let's try that again. You know, um, I don't think I'm supposed to be up here. <laughs> I kind of just jumped up here from here. Um, I don't think I'm supposed to be here, but for whatever reason, you are not working. Ah, uh, you know what? I think I'm at the wrong doors. I think it's supposed to be this door here. 
Um, and you know why? You know why I went to th that that other door is because the the airport card. Our little GPU card is connected. Okay, I don't, obviously I don't know how to drive now. You know, I think yeah, I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be the other doors. Mateo's big Dumbo. All right, let you know, let's 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 do some moving of. Uh, I, I'm sorry, I can't even speak English now. Let's let let's start by moving this around. Okay, so I'm gonna do Y. Um, can I? Thank you. Let's back it up. I'm just gonna back you up to right here. Okay, that thing has pretty good brakes. Now I'm gonna disconnect you. We are going to turn you around. Okay. You are now going to park right here. Okay. So now that you're parked right here, I can go here and I can connect that. There we go. That looks a lot more natural. Now, are you running? Okay, you are running. That's good. And obviously that says that the GPU is still connected. Okay, so now that we've done that, let's take this. And let's drive over here. I'm pretty sure that it's this door here that I'm supposed to be at. But obviously Mateo Big Dumbo. And uh, oh yeah, look, look, look. It even has lines marked for the for the door. It, you know, see see the lines that are nicely painted so that we come in here with the door. Okay. Um, I feel like I should be angled though. Because the way that the plane... You know, you'd want a nice, firm connection, and it's kind of a little crooked right there, isn't it? So if I put you down, are you going to freak out? No, you're not. Okay, nope, you're good. You're good and happy? Okay, good. That's good. Ah, there we go. Safety must be fully retracted. Sorry, what? What? Well, how does that make sense? Sorry, wait, you want it like that? Safety barriers, okay, like that, and then like that. What? Sorry, hold on. Let me back up and let me try this again. Hold on. I think I glitched this because... Uh, I think I glitched it. Hold on. Let me back this thing up again. <laughs> okay, so now if I move this, and then if I move this one, safety barriers must be fully retracted, but I did do such things. What? Sorry, did, did, I, did I screw something up? Okay, I cannot... Eh? Okay. I don't understand how that makes any sense, but okay. Uh, oh, okay. What? Hello? Uh, okay. Okay. Okay, I guess that's how that's supposed to work. I can now not enter the airplane. They don't want me to enter the plane. I guess I'm not allowed to enter. Okay, I guess that's how that works out. <laughs> we just we just did that. So now I have to go over here and I have to grab the luggage cart. So, ooh, I think I need the tractor though. Yeah, I'm going to need the tractor. So let's disconnect that. Hopefully that's fine. There we go. Man, I got to say, this is actually pretty good so far. I know they've had all those other airport simulators that have released and... Quite frankly, those ones are kind of repetitive. And I don't think any of those ones ever done well. But I'm actually having a really good time with that. So, what do I have to do first? I assume that I would have to grab the luggage cart. Let me just get out here for a second. So, I need to unload luggage. Okay, so I assume that I need this. So, let's... How about we grab this first? Okay. And I assume I would take it to the first one, right? I mean, I could take it to the second one probably, but... Why would I do such things? Hello? Why is there noise? Okay, so open that up. Uh, there's no luggage here. Sorry, is somebody leaving? That guy might be leaving right there. Can I open this one? Okay, I can open this one as well. I don't see any luggage in here, so... Okay, that's fine, I guess. Okay. I don't know why planes are making noise. It's kind of scary. I don't understand who's making noise. Okay, how do... Uh... Okay.
I wish that I could leave the, uh, the controls open. Okay, change direction. Ah, okay. Okay, I'm gonna leave it like that. And let's grab the tractor real quick. Why are airplanes making noise? Are you, oh, you're leaving. Look at that guy, he's leaving. Oh, that's actually amazing. That, that's actually pretty cool, okay. You know, that, that really makes the airport feel alive. I will just say that. Um, okay, so let's take tractor. And with the tractor, we're gonna... I would assume that we're gonna collect... Wait, hold on a second. What are you? Hello? I don't understand what you are. Okay, I just grabbed that. Uh, what, what does that do? I just grabbed tarp. Oh, do you think that the tarp is for this? Oh, F to cover. Oh, look at that. Okay, that's amazing. And then if I, I can do this one here. I think I can. Okay. Oh, look at that. Uh, are you also leaving? I don't know. There's a lot of noise and it's kind of stressing me out. Okay. <laughs> Let's, let's back this up. Let's grab the... F oh, no. This is... Oh, I hate these carts. I'm, I'm like, it's... Oh, no, maybe it's not. Okay, never mind. I was going to say, is it one of those carts with, like, the double axle kind of thing? You know, you know where the cart kind of, like... It, it has, like, a bearing in the, uh, in the first tr track right there. I, I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, hello, sir. We have another airplane. Uh, okay, that's cool. You know what would be really nice is if I could pull this guy. Let's back it up just a hair, and then... There we go. Okay, let's go. <laughs> uh... Okay, hello. Uh, hi, sir. Don't mind me. I'm just going to drive right past you. Wow, that's amazing. All right, let's, uh, let's, let's go this way. And I assume I was I would just park right here, right? Oh my god, there's so much noise. I don't understand. So that guy's leaving. This guy's just arrived. Okay, well that's cool. Um <laughs> Okay, so can I close this? Okay, I can cover that. And then I can cover this one. Okay, cool. Now, how does this operate? Can I can I like crawl in here maybe? So, it, it wants me to unload luggage, one of 19. Okay, so I can activate the belt. Okay, so is that how you operate? Uh, and then I can open that up. Oh, look at that, nice. Oh, look at that guy. He just took off. That was amazing. Okay, so he's out of here. <laughs> Hopefully having a more successful day than I'm having. Okay, can I just say one thing? Um, I'm trying to figure out why this belt loader's not working. And um, i just like to point out that Jeff Faviano also played this. And for whatever reason, he's got like a full-blown tutorial going on explaining how to do everything. And, um, well, I'm going to say one thing. I'm... I've made it this far without a tutorial. So <laughs> in his video of this game, he's got like markers and pictures and images to show him what he's got to do. And me, I guess I'm playing hardcore. So you know what? Be proud of me. I made it this far in having, you know, no idea what I'm doing. So in his video, he had like a big box here. And essentially he drove, can I close this? He, okay, let me cover the tarp in there. And he drove the, like, baggage cart um, into the box. I, I don't know if that's how this works. I don't understand. Why, why, why am I not, why? Hello. Oh, I'm sorry. Ow, that's probably going to cost some money. Okay. So I put you there, and then if I uncover you, no luggage comes out, and I don't understand why. 
Huh. Okay. Okay, so I realize we're playing a scenario here. We're not playing the tutorial, which probably wasn't a good idea, but anyways, here we are. So, um, what I have to do is I have to contact a ground crew. In order to do that, I have to hit the tilde key. And then if I go to ground crew and I can do luggage, and then if I do luggage back, there we go. That's how it works. Okay, nice. Yep, 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 yep. There we go. So, <laughs> I probably should have played the tutorial first. Instead, Mateo was like, hey, let's go right in. So, you know what? That's what I did. I went right in. No tutorial needed. So, here we go. We can, uh, you know, it'd be nice if I could, like, better, if I could just, like, eat these. Uh, okay. Do you, okay, you'll get stuck. So, let me just eat you over there. Shablam, shablam. 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 A lot of red. Okay, cool. So, all right, I'm learning here. Uh, <laughs> Hey, I'm learning here. There we go. So that is the last one for there. That, you know, amazing stacking skills. Um, is that everything? No, that's not. That's okay. So that, that, that's, that's not everything. All right. So if I close that now, um, and then I can close the tarp. There we go. Very nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, cool. Now, is this going to be like farming simulator that, you know, the pre, um, sticky trailer days, you know, when you'd load bales on. Okay. No, okay. No, Cargo's moving around. Cargo's... Oh, I just got stuck. Okay, I hit something. I don't know what I hit. Oh, I hit the cone. No. Okay, so now that I did that, let's leave that right there. And let's grab the thing. Okay. Alright, so I assume... Wait a minute. Hold on. Just out of curiosity, if I was to go here... Okay, now I have to do the front, I assume. Okay, so if I go here... Now, let's back this thing up, and let's go to the other one. Okay. You see, I probably should... Uh, I'm telling you, I should have done the tutorial. <laughs> Mateo didn't do the tutorial, and, um, well, this is what happens. Meanwhile, Jeff Faviano, the former uh, ramp agent, because prior to his YouTube days, um, he actually worked at as a ramp agent, I believe it was at St. Louis. And, um, well, even he used the tutorial. So, Mateo, stop trying to be some amazing human. Stop trying to be some guy who knows everything and just load up the tutorial, will ya? Okay, do you reckon that'll work? I don't think that'll work. Which, apparently, some of the, uh, some of the features in this scenario are actually bugged. Um, but apparently, they've worked for me, so I don't know. Because, uh, Jeff Faviano actually was playing this scenario to begin with. And then he was trying to line up the stairway, and he was mentioning about how apparently the stairway wasn't working, and yet somehow we were able to make it work. So, um, yay me. Uh, <laughs> the guy who has absolutely no experience as a ramp agent was able to do this, no tutorials needed. Um, yeah, yay me. Okay, good. You're kind of working. Yeah, you're working. All right, this is cool. Uh, you know what? How about we actually try to stack like we're professionals? Gonna have to kind of farming simulator this when I'm like hand stacking hay bales, you know? There we go. I'm sorry if this is making anyone really dizzy. I need to, I need to be very careful with the mouse sensitivity. If, if we could have a setting for mouse sensitivity, that'd be grand. Although this is a, you know, a demo. The game is not released yet. So bear in mind that some of the, oh my gosh. Sorry, I hope that nothing was breakable in here. Oh my goodness. Everything's breaking. This is great. Sorry, anyways, like I was saying, um, you know, obviously this game, this is just a demo, so I do apologize if, uh, you know, any of the uh, things look very weird. I mean, I don't know why I'm apologizing, but yeah, that's, you know, something important to know when you play games like this, that, you know, it is just early access. Now, out of curiosity, can I do this again? No, I can't. That's good to know. Okay, so now let's uh, let's go here. Let's stop this thing. And I assume that I... Oops, that's not what I want to do. Close that. Close that up. Okay, um, so let's take this now. And I assume that what I would want to do is drive this over to the little luggage facility, which is would make a lot of sense. Now, I can't really fit into this place, so I'm just going to leave this right here, and I assume 
that if I start one of these, so like, let's just say I start this one, um, I can just start unloading this, right? Is this, is this what it wants me to do? Okay, yep, I mean, it's working. Uh, I feel like that should be a little more centered. Okay, there we go. Well, let's just start unloading this then. Nice. All right, cool. Blam, there we go. And this is, in fact, counting as luggage being loaded. So, um, once it goes through there, it just keeps going. Okay, and it disappears. And then you can see here, 2 out of 19. So, that is really nice to see. Uh, okay, I hope there was nothing breakable in that one. <laughs> all right, now all, all now, now, now to get all the red suitcases. Okay, this is good. You know, I gotta say, I'm very glad that this truck... Or this tractor has a nice little turning radius here, because I imagine there's not a lot of space right here. Okay, so now that I did that, now I can unload this one. Yay, awesome, cool. And last but not least, this one here. Alright, so I put that down, and uh, 15 out of 19, so that's 16, yep, 17, and then 18, and last but not least, 19 is going in. Nice. So, did, 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 uh, did Mateo beat the game? Hey, I beat the game, so now what? <laughs> uh, are you done now? I is this it? Oh, okay. Wait for service at 2.11. Okay. So, I guess I beat the game? 2.11. Okay. Oh, okay. So, now, what I can do... Signal flight crew to start APU. Okay. So, this is the outbound stuff. Why do I have to wait so long? Okay, cool. Well, that that's fine. So I guess they're going to load people, and we should keep this right here because we're going to need to load the airplane with luggage. Request the luggage by turning on conveyor belts, and load luggage to forward hold, and... Okay, cool. All right, cool. So I guess, uh, I guess we got to wait now. Don't mind me. I'm just patiently waiting for departure time. Um, I got to say... Uh, Pretty good game so far. I actually can't wait for the uh, full release. I think it'll be very interesting when it does. Um, all the question is, when the game fully releases, are we going to have, like, AI helping us? Like, are we going to have an AI team that we can manage? You know, where I'm like, okay, I want my AI to go and grab the baggage cart, and then I want another AI to go grab the staircase. Meanwhile, while they're doing that, I'm going to go grab the APU. Are we going to have things like that? I think that'd be pretty cool. I don't know. I guess time will tell, but I'm just kind of chilling here, and um, we're patiently waiting for departure time, so... <laughs> ah, yes. Yes. I mean, this is a normal place to wait, right? <laughs> okay, it is now 2.11, and we can begin departure, so disconnect the stairway, um, and then after we do that, we have to load bu load buggage? Load buggage. Load the luggage, and then disconnect the GPU. Alright, cool. Easy enough. Can I just, like, eat myself... Oh, uh... Oh. No, okay, I guess I can do. <laughs> All right, so <laughs> first things first, let's get the uh, stairway, right? That's what they want? Yes, they want me to remove the stairway, and then... So I remove that, and then remove that, and then I close the door. Yes, there we go. See, that makes sense. I didn't understand why they wanted that retracted. Obviously, that needs to be retracted to open up the door. So it makes a lot more sense now. So, all right, so now if I just remove the supports and I can just back myself up all right nice now where can I put this uh, maybe just over here for now yes and let's crash into the building shall we um, okay so now what uh, need to grab the luggage request the luggage by turning on the conveyor belts load luggage load luggage I would assume that this is where I need to do uh no Ah, okay, so the loading luggage is this one, I assume. Ah, there we go. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so what happens if that bag just keeps moving? I, I assume it falls, right? Uh, I, I assume it would fall? Maybe, maybe I should stop it right there. Okay, I'm going to stop that right there. Does any luggage come out of there? No, no luggage comes out of that one. That is good to know. Okay, let's bring the little truck over and start loading luggage. You know, I really wish there was more space here. Alright, so let me open this up. 
And then if I turn on the old conveyor belt. Now, okay, yep, and the luggage is just going to fall. That's great. All right, let's start loading this. Bloom. And shablam. And it says it wants 15 on both. So, uh, so that's five. Let's do 15 in both carts. And then that way we don't overload one side. So that's six. And last but not least, 15. Here we go. So I'm going to have to try to shimmy this in here. Oh, okay. There we go. 15. And I can now close that. Nice. And now to load 15 into the other one. Here we go. And last but not least, the 15th for the second cart. I must say, okay, listen, I stack hay bales during the summer, okay? When the hay season is in effect. And I promise you, I stack much better than this. If you would like, I have pictures to prove that I can stack things nicely. <laughs> Unless you're talking about that one flatbed trailer that my boss has. That trailer is awful. I hate stacking it. Um, I never like to stack it alone because it doesn't have sides and it's, it's awful. Okay, and let's begin. So I assume, uh-oh, okay, <laughs> yep, I, it's, it, oh, ooh, I'm really sorry. I hope there was nothing breakable in that. That looked expensive. <laughs> uh, s please, please move. Okay. <laughs> I know what I'm doing, okay? I stack hay bales, okay? It's, it's basically like stacking hay bales, although... You know, we have, like, those hay loaders, right? You know, it's like the little belt loader, you know, and you can load hay bales into a barn and stuff like that. Never used one of those. So, in my defense, okay, I, I don't really know how, like, belt loaders work. We don't have one. So, <laughs> yeah, I got to stack it all by hand when it's off of the trailer. So, there you go. Yeah, there you go. In my defense. So, shablam, and then this one. I guess I'm doing this one. Will that fit? It fits. It works. Why are those so far away? What what happened? Okay, can you move, dude? Buddy, please. Don't got time for this. Uh, I hope that wasn't expensive. And last but not least, this one. There we go. And so that should be 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And it goes in there, goes bye-bye, kind of roleplay that somebody's in there. Um, somebody's in there stacking it. So there we go. Okay. Let's, <laughs> let's get this one here. Uh, uncover, open that up. And, oh, I'm really sorry. I hope that didn't have anything expensive. Uh, are you going to work? Yeah, I don't think that's, yeah, you're, you're not supposed to go there, buddy. You're supposed to go there. There we go. Get the green one. Get the little, uh, briefcase, or not briefcase. Get the, uh, what do they call that? What, what, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, Da, 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 uh, uh, bank robber uh, sports bag. Yeah. I don't know. I always picture it's like the bank robbers, you know, in those kind of like, they always wear those kind of like uh, sport. I, I don't know what I'm saying. You know what? I just need to stop talking. Shablam. Shablam. Okay. And then shablam. Uh, get this next one here. Shablam. And last but not least, shablam. There we go. And you're just going to go up there all happy. And so that is 12, 13, 14, 13, 14, 15. Okay, sorry. Mateo doesn't know how to count. And let's drive this over here. Yay, it's done. Okay, so I am just going to drive this over here. And we can, we can park it right at the doorway. There we go. Welcome. And now to just close the doors here. So close the door and we will back this thing up and then close the door. Uh, where should I back this up to? Um, over here. Let's, uh, let's back this up so it's well out of the way. Oh, you know what I just realized? I wonder, does this thing have a, whatchamacallit? No, it doesn't. I was going to say, I wonder if this has a little tow hitch. To be able to pull this away, because I realize I'm gonna need the tractor. So uh, let's let's not become comfortable here. Oh, I let's back this up, and then what I will do is I'll disconnect that, and then we will bring this over here. Man, I'm glad that the turning on this is really good <laughs> for the amount of space that we're trying to work with here. Okay, and then what I can do is just back this up like so. Shablam. And then connect that. Oh my gosh, that was a little scary. Uh, okay. 
Let me close this up before I forget about it. Okay. And now that I did that, uh, signal flight crew to start the APU. Okay. This is where we would want our headphones. I, I guess I didn't have to wear my headphones during any of that. So, tilde, and then if I go to flight deck and I say APU, turn on APU. Then once they turn on the APU, I wait for that and then I can disconnect the GPU. Okay, nice. Hey, can you stop beeping? Thank you. Okay, so they're starting up the APU. Okay, so the APU is now started, and what I can do is I can disconnect this. Um, now, after I disconnect this, do I just drive it away? Can I turn it off? Wait, if I do that... Okay, good, I can turn that off. Okay, good, I turned it off. Nice. And I can close that up. Good, there we go. Let's be professional about this, shall we? Okay, so I will now take this over here. And I will just leave this right here. <laughs> I mean, yeah, this is great. So now what? So after I did that, remove the chokes, remove the cones. All right, so we will remove this one here. And do I just pick these up? Okay, I guess I just pick them up. I don't actually, like, set them anywhere. Okay, blam. And then I can remove this last one. I guess I don't need to set these down. When I'm picking them up, it just kind of... All right, and then we will remove the cones. Oh, okay, but it okay, but it has me pick up the cones. Okay, that's good to know. Back this up. Shablam. You know what? As I'm thinking about it, I'm surprised that um, the game gave me, like, a cone tutorial. Remember when we were putting the cones in place? Um, it had little spots for me to put the cones. And uh, I'm kind of surprised that it, it gave that to me, but it didn't give, like... I don't know. I I guess I'm figuring that it would have had me do it all from memory. Oh, man. We would have still been doing the cones <laughs> had that been the case. All right. Well, that's, that's, that's perfectly fine. So now that I remove this out of the way, are you happy? Uh... Oh. You're not happy about this. Okay. You want these further away? Like over here kind of further away? Oh, okay. Yep, yep. It's it's just mad about these cones here. Okay, that's cool. So maybe had it not shown me the cone tutorial, it wouldn't have been so mad about it. Okay. I remove all the cones. Are you leaving? Look at that. So the airplane is leaving. Engine number two has started. You know what? I'm a little bit curious about something. Can I... I can't ride on this anymore. Be oh, wait, wait, wait. I gotta close this. That wouldn't have been good. Wait until animation is fully finished. Okay. Well, that wouldn't have been good, now would it? Um, ooh, wait a minute. I'm just curious. Can I... Can I just, like... Well, there we go. Look at this. So, the plane is leaving. We have successfully turned a plane around. So proud of myself. <laughs> and look at this. No tutorial needed. The only thing I needed to do was watch Jeff Fabiano for two seconds to realize that I needed to use this. Because I had no idea this was a thing, because guess who didn't play the tutorial? Guess who never read the manuals? Me, I never read the manuals. So, are you leaving? Man, look at that lighting. I gotta say, that, 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 that red flashing beacon, look at the way that it's reflecting off of the ground there. That looks amazing. Are you leaving, sir? Okay, I think engine number one is beginning. Um, I hear noises. I hear noises. Man, I gotta say, the time that it's taking for these engines to start up and everything is pretty nice. It's, it's kind of like, you know, when you're at, like, the air show, you know, and you see, like, the airplane engine starting up and you're waiting, you know? It's just kind of what it feels like. Oh, look at that. He's reverse thrust, I assume. Maybe one day we will have pushback tugs and we will be able to uh, push the airplane out. Okay. Now, I am a little bit curious. Do the wheels turn? Oh, look at that. Okay, I mean, it was, it was, it was very sudden, but... Oh, that's amazing. Look at that beautiful bird. <laughs> that is nice. 
So he is turning around, and uh, I assume that all the passengers are stowed away and ready to go. Um, although we didn't meet any passengers for this run, unfortunately. What does this sound like without headphones? Not bad. Okay, so he is leaving. Can we watch him depart? Now, I would run after him. However, um, if you run too far, the map, uh, the, the game gives you a warning. So I'm just, you know what, maybe, maybe, or maybe, maybe it won't do. I'm, I'm, I'm going to just run after this airplane and show you what happens if you go too far away. Uh, the game gives you a warning and it's like, oh, maybe it's not going to? Uh, okay, weird. Because I know if you go to where those helicopters are, the game freaks out. Uh, okay, apparently I can just run. Um, so I went over to those helicopters over there while I was waiting for the plane to depart. And the game gave me a warning that I had to return to the play area. So apparently it's not doing this now? I am a little bit scared to go too far because what if we fall... Well, what if we fall out of the world? You know what? Let's wait for the plane to depart, and then we will, um, we'll go exploring, okay? And if we fall out of the world, who cares? Okay, so I can stay on the runway, but look what happens when I walk on the grass. Go back to game area. Four seconds. The game gives me a mega warning, so I guess I have to stay on airport property. Uh, I don't see airplane anymore. Although, I hear something. I hear noises. Oh, look, there he is. Nice. So, I had the headphones off because I wanted to hear noise. Well, there we go. So, the plane that we have serviced just departed. Very nice. So, now, can I can I service more planes? Is, is this all it wanted me to service? Okay, so I guess I beat the game. <laughs> okay, before we end the episode, I want to do one thing. I'm going to take the tractor out. And uh, we are going to go this way and see what we can find. Um, I... I I'm kind of curious what's at the other end of the runway. Obviously, because it's raining, we can't really see anything. Um, so we're just going to go drive and see what we can find. Because <laughs> it won't be an episode of Mateo Tube if we did not explore. Because that's what I seem to do in every game that I play. <laughs> I always go exploring. So let's, let's go do that. Maybe this isn't the safest thing, but obviously in real life, I assume that you would want to have uh, permission from Tower. Um, we have permission. Um, because I said so. Because I am Tower. You know, to be honest, I have no idea what I'm going to find out here. We're just going down the runway. <laughs> um, I guess I beat the game, which means that, uh, we're... I was, I was hoping that there'd be, like, an end game condition. Or be like, wow, you beat the demo, yay! Um, that doesn't seem to be the case, which I'm okay with, because it allows us to explore, so... Um, let's take the opportunity while the game allows us to, um, have fun, to have fun. Hopefully you enjoyed this. I honestly think this will be a really good game. Um, hopefully we can have AI work with us, because I think that, um, I, I think having AI could make the airport come alive even more. Um, but obviously this game is going to be releasing in quarter three of 2023, so we have quite a ways to go until then. Um... Which means that we have quite a ways to go um, before we have a final product. So, I guess what we see here is promising. Hopefully, hopefully it'll, uh, it it'll be good. You know, I was just thinking about this. Um, I kind of like that they actually modeled in the entire runway. Something that kind of... I'm curious as to how far they're actually going to take this game. Um, at the end of the day, this game is called Airport Sim. Which implies that you, you could do... It, it implies that it's an airport simulator. It's not called ground handling simulator. It's called airport simulator. So I wonder if this would imply that maybe one day we'll see, like, runway maintenance, you know? Where maybe you have to go service a runway. 
and you have to like make sure that the runway is clear and safe. Um, I don't really know. I guess that's something we can see in the future, but look at this. Very nice. I would drive back, but to be honest, the tractor is very slow. For, so with that said, hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give it a like. Tomorrow, I plan to have some Train Sim World. Um, I want to play, uh, I want to play the Spirit of Steam. Um, uh, because I've been playing that on my own time, and I've been enjoying it. So, I was hoping to do a video on that. And, um, well, with that said, um, let me just, let me just have a coughing fit. <laughs> with that said, this is Airport Sim. Thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. See you later. Peace. Is there a horn? Okay, there's lights. Uh, is there beacons? Oh, 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 turns on the beacons. Very nice. Okay, no tail lights though, which is weird, but that's okay. Anyways, thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. See you later. Peace.